Hey guys, things have been going pretty solid for Halo Infinite since the winter update release, but one thing I saw a lot of Halo fans talking about was the removal of Bot Boot Camp, which was essentially the only PvE mode in the game. And with the winter update, 343 decided to remove this just out of the blue, and it really upset a lot of Halo fans. Well, finally, Sketch from 343 has responded about this, and here's what he said. The Bot Boot Camp playlist will be returning. It will take some time, the team wants to look at some potential tweaks, more details to come. So I guess at the very least we know it is returning to the game. I'm honestly not too sure what tweaks they could make to that game mode. Maybe they're going to increase the bot difficulty. That's the only thing I could see, but it is typical for 343 to say it's coming soon. Because Sketch said it will take some time, I've got a funny feeling it won't come back until the December drop pod update. Now, a lot of Halo players don't know this, but with the winter update, 343 have decided to finally add campaign rewards. The Requiem Revengeance stance is coming alongside the Active Genesis stance. Both of these were previously locked, and it was so annoying just not knowing how to unlock these items, but finally you can play the campaign and unlock them. And in addition to that, there is a UNSC in Infinity Weapon Charm, and you get all of this for just getting the 100% on the campaign. Now with Mission Replay, that shouldn't be too hard to do. I wish there were more unique rewards, like a really cool armor coating or a legendary helmet. That would really give those who completed the campaign on, say, legendary, a really nice sense of achievement. I definitely think we still need that. So that's just a bit of small news to keep you going. As always, if you enjoy these short videos, please do sub to the channel. I'd really appreciate it. And with that said, I'll see you next time. Have a good one.